Hey, what's up? It's me, Roman. Today's vlog is about our middle school experience. So behind me, I have my friend Scum. Basically about us saying some events that happened that kind of changed our lives and changed us as a whole as a person. So without further ado, let's go. Okay, hi. So here's one. One of my experiences would be bullying. Now, not everyone faces bullying, but if you are facing it and even cyberbullying, my advice would be to you is just try your best to ignore it and just look at the little parts. Just make the little parts seem more than they are. Like, say you woke up and like, I don't know, say you're from France as an example. You're like, oh my God, I'm so glad I woke up in this very nice country, right? Just the little, the, the little things that make everything better. Just think about the little things because you gotta be more grateful where you are at the moment. Um, now I'm gonna talk about my story. So I had, I've been dealing with bullying ever since fourth grade for like the dumbest stuff. And I mean, it ended since I entered high school, but I remember being um, very roasted back in sixth grade just for my glasses. And back then I was wearing uh, Skechers, if you remember that. Remember those type of shoes, you know, the little kids uh, that they wear. Uh, my friend Scum is gonna go next, one of his, tell one of his events, so I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just slide it straight to him. I remember going to the cruise pool, and I shot myself in it, and I didn't say anything about anything about it for 30 minutes. Until it just, the water started turning brown, and I just left immediately. <laughs> oh, why? Very nice experience. Uh, advice? Use the bathroom before you go anywhere. Please help. Back in sixth grade, I used to have this friend. I'm gonna call him Jim. So, Jimbo. So, Jim used to be this kid that fought a lot, and I mean a lot, a lot. So, every class, he would fight with this other dude. Let's call him, let's call him John. They kept on fighting, right? And they kept kind of getting into trouble, and etc., etc. And one time he fought him again, but this time he did the very naughty thing, if, you, if I were to put it like that. He hit him so hard that he fell unconscious. Yeah, and it's all happened outside and it was crazy. So what I'm trying to say here is think, think before you do the action. Just remember, uh, just make sure you're doing the right uh, thing. So anyways, right now we're just gonna go head outside and nice view. Like always, we chill here. It's our hot spot. If you. Oh, I like that. Anyways, I'm out of here. Screw it. Okay, now it's his turn. The advice he used last time was actually his. I kind of stole it. <laughs> but um, anyways, tell all about your other event. No, oh, actually, it's what happened. Well, what's it called? You know the Mexicans in our school? And you know how they like to fight people, right? Yeah. Well, I was a part of their uh, little gang before. Okay. So, one of the, uh, I got into a fight with one of like, the little people, uh, the gang or whatever. So you got into a fight because of that? Very yeah, nice. What? So what advice would you give? Use rocks. <laughs> Use rocks? Okay. Very nice. So last one, it kind of matches with the, the first one which I talked about bullying. But basically, don't care what others think of you because their opinion is irrelevant to you. Like seriously. like. When, when people get depressed about like hating themselves and such Yeah, but you realize it's easier to say than actually it, Yes, it very much is, but the mindset basically changes everything So just try to think more positively It's a husky hmm? Cute dog Well anyways, those are just some events that, I, that, that happened to me in middle school I might talk about uh, my middle school more because it's kind of a lot of stories it was kind of nice talking with Scum. He had some pretty good points in some of which, even though most of them were just fights. <laughs> a lot of them were fights, let's be honest. So for now, we're just going to be chilling for a bit. Then we're going to be heading home. Very ghetto. Welcome to New York City, I guess, but. Today's a very nice day. It's pretty cool. Very nice weather, very windy. So it's like one of those times where it just feels so great. Look at the trees, it's so green, very nice. Oh yeah, and I really much like this. See ya. Very nice. Look at that sunset. So pretty. Anyways, that'll be it for today. Thank you for coming in. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you really, really liked it, you can sub. Um, I'll, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thank you all for coming. Have an amazing day, and until next time.
Bye.